Hi, I'm Dan with Intermatic's technical support team. Today I'll be demonstrating how to install the ST01C timer in a single pole application. Before we get started, there's a couple things I want to cover. When working on any electronic device, it's very important that you turn the power off at the circuit breaker before working on that device. Additionally, to install the timer, we're going to need a couple tools. We're going to need a flat blade screwdriver as well as a Phillips head screwdriver. Now let's get started. Since this is a single pole installation, we're going to locate the red wire on the timer and place a wire nut on it as it is not used in this application. Now that we have the red wire capped off, we can remove our switch from the wall. And we will locate one of the wires that is connected on the switch and remove it Now that we have the wire disconnected, we will connect it to the black wire on the timer. We will remove the remaining wire from your regular wall switch and connect it with the blue wire on the timer. If you have a green ground wire in your box, we can connect it to the green ground wire on the timer. If you do not have a ground wire in your box, it is not necessary for the timer to operate as it will work with or without a ground. All the connections are complete on the timer, so we will insert it back into the wall. Now that the timer is secured to the wall box, we will put the decorator style cover plate on. So now that the timer is completely installed in the wall, it's safe to turn the power back on at the circuit breaker so we can test the timer, make sure it turns both on and off. To do so, all you need to do is press the door that covers the buttons, press it once, the light turns on, press it again, the light should turn off. This concludes our installation of an ST01C timer in a single pole application. For more information about our products, please visit us online at www.intermatic.com.